in here and save us. Uh, we're talked out now. What are we talking about? Tell, well, tell us your about salute. Your Have you perfected yours? Tell us yours? about your character and why you like it. Yeah. Salute goes here. You don't have a cover on. I don't have a cover, so I can't sleep. Uh, that's my how we made that mistake once, oh, sure. didn't we? Yeah, and actually they... What's the deal? You're not, you're not allowed to do it without a cover on? Or you're, it's it's inappropriate. Yep. Actually, I should be wearing... Technically, I should be wearing one in uniform outside, but... We take liberties. At times. <laughs> lunch. Lunch, yes, lunch. Uh, I play Danny Green. I am the uh, Naval Mountain Warfare Division. It's the Navy SEAL. Uh, so I get to go on a lot of the fun missions uh, that are off the ship. Right. Spend a lot of time in the water. I'm gonna bow out now. <laughs> Bye guys. Bye. Thank you very much. Uh, do I spend a lot of time uh -huh. in the water? Um, yes. There's been a lot of time that we spent on the ribs, leaving the ship, going to different locations. Yeah. And this is my little relationship. <laughs> Aww. Aww. Under the radar. <laughs> What happens? What's the consequence? You, you said it's inappropriate. No, no. Completely inappropriate. Yes. What you happens? You get kicked off the ship. Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. You can. You can. Luckily for you, that won't happen, right? In this situation. <laughs> well, the world is ending. I think we have bigger problems to deal with. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> so. uh -huh. Technically, what you're doing is good for the population. You know, if we have to restart a civilization, <laughs> that might be some uh, some good work, and some good hours to put into that. Huh? <laughs> So if you're the guy that goes le to the land, what's your favorite uh, action sequence this season so far? Uh, well, I don't want to give away too much, but there's there's been there's been a lot that we've had to do. Um, I don't know what I can say or cannot say, but there's some stuff where we go through the jungle, which is a lot of fun. The monkeys, <laughs> the monkeys. again. For the, monkeys. the monkeys. It's the monkeys. You know. <laughs> That's my favorite part. Yeah, she's in love with. <laughs> I'm in love with Crystal. <laughs> Uh, but there's there's always a lot that we're up against, and we don't really realize that until it's too late. So a lot of times we find ourselves in, in quite the situation that we have we have to get out of these extraordinary circumstances. And it's always fun as as an actor to to have a gun in your hand <laughs> and to have to you know strategize with your friends and, and to play to play with big toys. That these actual right. the, the real armed forces they they do this for a living. If they dedicate their lives to it, we could hope to even get close to embodying what they actually go through. Hopefully they'll be proud of what we're doing. Did you go through like SEAL type training beforehand? Do you know what the SEAL, the, the training that they go through? <laughs> That's why I asked him hesitantly. <laughs> These guys. <laughs> I, I studied up a lot of what they go through and they dedicate everything they have to their training. We didn't go through a small portion of what these men go through. Uh, we, we went through gun training, we learned how to shoot, um, I did some knife training, I did some Muay Thai training, and I just studied a lot of the psychology of combat. So, no, <laughs> I didn't do basically anything of what the real Navy SEALs do, because they are badasses. Do you do your own stunts, or most of it? The stunts that I, I'll do the stunts that they allow me to do. Right. I want to do all of them, and a lot of the times they say, you can't do that. Um, so, the ones that they let me do, yes. I. I definitely do those. You're working with the dog too, right? I do. So talk about working with, because you know, they say never to work with animals or children. So they steal the scene, right? Yes. Yeah. How's the experience been? Uh, his name is Nick, the dog that we've been working with. And he's, he's definitely cuter than me, so he will be a scene stealer. <laughs> uh, but it's great working with him. He's such, he's, he's trained, he's professional. And I'm just so surprised how, how well behaved these dogs are. Like Nick is, they actually have a lot of dogs on the ship. Like the Navy, they use dogs in combat, and uh, I think we're really using, uh, his name is Halsey on the show, I Here think we're, <laughs> it's not Halsey, <laughs> Halsey's much more vicious than that. That's <laughs> Watson. Um, but I think we're, we're using the, the dog as the Navy would actually use it, uh, the dog on the Each plane has combat. to use dogs in combat on the ocean? Huh? Uh, they, well, not, not necessarily on the ship, okay. but when they go on a mission, they, they usually do have uh, a canine, they'll have a dog they use in combat for um to save the scientists right to save scientists <laughs> duh <laughs> yep they the, the dogs can sniff out things whether it be for drugs or bombs or whatever they the dogs just have the a different sense than we have um, and they can also be used to attack so it's just another asset you can have so, wait, so is Nick a trained Hollywood dog, or is he a trained 
like he's seal a, though. He's a trained Hollywood dog. <laughs> <laughs> but when we went to the Arctic to shoot, uh, we had a trained uh, as a dog that, that they had gotten from uh, the police force. And this dog, I could not pet. We couldn't be friendly with because it was trained to kill. Um, so we have used. I forgot his the dog's name, but you'll see. In the, did you guys watch the pilot? Yes. 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 Admiral, right? Isn't that? Ad dog's name? Yep. Yeah, yeah, Admiral yeah. Halsey. Yeah. So the dog in the pilot, that was the real police dog. Vicious. And how, how was the that huge sequence on Arctic? How, how, what, where? It, it was amazing was it cold. <laughs> was, where was it? Uh, we were in Smithers, British Columbia. Right. And it was a lot of fun to shoot because there was blizzards and it was just freezing. We took these little carts to like get all the way up the mountain. Um, it's fun shooting in the cold because your face gets numb and you're having trouble <laughs> saying your dialogue, but it's, that's, that's the fun stuff as an actor. And you know, you have, again, you're on a snowmobile, I have a gun in my hand, rocket launcher, all this like the stuff that you dream of as a kid. Like I'm, I'm, I'm doing all right. these, like, I'm, this is a dream job. I'm very, very, very lucky. To How long do you take it to shoot the, the entire sequence? How long? Uh, it? That stuff took us two days. Pretty quick. Yeah. Pretty quick. Yeah. Michael Bay moves fast. <laughs> and he knows what he's doing. Was he around? Uh, he was. Oh. Yep. For that portion, he was definitely around. He directed that portion. Oh, yeah. nice. Yeah. Let's see. <laughs> Do you guys have a favorite, uh, you know, Navy set, ship set, you know, military set movie or TV show from the, that you just personally really like? Crossing <laughs> Saving Private Ryan. <laughs> Three Kings was one that I always enjoyed. I, I always loved the, the personality behind that. I thought there was great energy and the, the camaraderie. Yeah. Uh, I watched On the Beach with Gregory Peck uh, when I found out uh, about this job. And if you go back to the classics, they do a pretty good job with that. 